Hi there, it's Dave Altavilla for Hot Hardware, and today we're going to take a look at the Nokia Lumia 1020 Windows Phone. This is Nokia's latest flagship smartphone, and it sports a 41 megapixel HD camera, if you can believe that, with Nokia's PureView technology, floating optical image stabilization, and a Carl Zeiss lens. With an MSRP of $299 currently on AT&T's network, it's powered by a dual-core Qualcomm Snapdragon processor at 1.5 GHz, 2 GB of RAM, and 32 GB of onboard storage. Though it's not a drag racer in terms of its internal processing horsepower, this Windows Phone device feels very responsive, loads apps quickly, and handles most smartphone workloads with relative ease. On the front of the 1020 is a 1.2 megapixel wide-angle front-facing camera. Along the bottom edge, there's a micro USB port and the phone's speaker. The left edge is clean and the phone is built with a solid high-density plastic that feels really good in the hand. Up top is a headphone port, a reset port, and the SIM card slot. On the right edge of the 1020, there's a camera function button down here in the bottom, power lock, and up here is the volume rocker. The materials, build quality, fit and finish of the Lumia 1020 are second to none. It really is a well-made quality device. But the main attraction of the Lumia 1020 aren't its standard Windows Phone 8 features and its excellent build quality, but rather its standout high-resolution onboard HD camera that easily rivals any point-and-shoot in the market today. The camera does protrude out at the back of the device a little bit, but it also comes equipped with a rear-facing Xenon flash. And quickly comparing the Lumia 1020's display versus some of the other high-end smartphones in the market. Over here on the left is the LG Optimus G Pro. In the middle is the Lumia 1020. And on the right is the Samsung Galaxy S3. And versus some of these higher-end smartphones, the 4.5-inch Pure Motion HD AMOLED display in the Lumia has a native resolution of 768 by 1280 with a 334 ppi pixel density. It doesn't quite offer the same screen real estate obviously as some of these larger displays but it does have excellent color reproduction contrast sharpness and detail that rivals any high-end smartphone uh, AMOLED display for example on the Samsung device uh, on the market today now in terms of its software and operating system, the Lumia 1020 offers the latest Windows Phone 8 experience, which has a solid assortment of built-in features like navigation, a music player, Facebook and Xbox integration, and uh, Local Scout. It's a handy app that works with Bing Maps to help you find local attractions nearby like restaurants, etc. Where Windows Phone 8 still does come up short is the Microsoft Store, which still just doesn't have the critical mass of Google Play or the Apple App Store. With major titles like Instagram, unfortunately, surprisingly missing and unavailable for a device that differentiates itself based on a high-end camera. But boy, this is a seriously nice camera on board, especially for a smartphone. Shutterbugs, if this is a must-have key feature for you, the folks at Nokia might have you sold. Nokia's ProCam app has an amazing assortment of controls and functionality built in, like different image framing grids to choose from, white balance control, ISO settings, exposure, focus, you name it. You can drag all of these controls around in a really slick dial interface as well, and it lets you set up your shots just right. Still images are snapped with two versions of the shot, a 5 megapixel standard resolution shot that's derived from the full resolution image, as well as a high resolution 11 megabyte JPEG that's recorded at a whopping 7700 by 4300 resolution. Image quality is miles ahead of any smartphone camera we've tested in outdoor settings with detail, sharpness, and color balance that quite frankly are stunning. Again, especially when you consider this as a smartphone camera. Under low light conditions, the image stabilization of the Lumia 1020 really helps minimize motion blur, and the results are again impressive. HD video recording is also simply fantastic, again with image stabilization affording the average novice with a less than steady hand the ability to capture clean jitter free footage. And the onboard mic isn't bad either, it does a pretty good job of capturing audio. Get them! They're fast, no question about it. Get them Max! 
So in short, if you're satisfied with the current capabilities of Windows Phone 8 and aren't looking to have the fastest smartphone processing engine on the block, the Nokia Lumia 1020 offers a very attractive option and a very high quality device with amazingly good camera performance and image processing capabilities. I'm Dave Altavilla for Hot Hardware. Make sure you stop by our site for the full review. This has been a quick take look at the Nokia Lumia 1020. Thanks for stopping by.